Hey, uh, let me restart that. Hey guys, uh, no, no, no. Hey guys, welcome back to the white void of nothingness. So I'm bored and I never go on Pinterest. So let's search LPS Custom on Pinterest and see what we find. Okay, so I am recording this on a very poopy phone recorder, but we're gonna deal with it. It'll look fine, hopefully. We're not gonna question it. Okay, so the first one I see it is this little kitty that's like a little clown kitty. This is cute. You know, this is what I expect to be on Pinterest. Adorable little customs. Then we got a guitar. Okay. <laughs> but, uh, so many ads. Wow. Second custom is this little chihuahua with the cutest heart cheeks. Oh my gosh. Heart on its chest, heart on its cheek, heart on its little eyebrows, hearts in its eyeballs. This is the heart chihuahua and it is adorable. It's all stitched up like a little stuffed animal. Very cute. This next one, ooh, I recognize this style. Um, is this by, oh, the name is escaping me. I just know this artist. I know this artist on Instagram. They make really interesting customs. That collar is very impressive. Wow, look at the little spikes and it's got a little chain with a star on it. Very cute, very Pinterest. Oh. My gosh, that is so cute. <laughs> oh my gosh. It is the cutest little cat I've ever seen. Oh my, it's so fluffy. Oh my gosh, it's so fluffy. Um, I want 10 of them right now. That is so cute. Guys, I'm gonna make more cow customs. Ooh, that's pumpkin. It's so cute. It's got, wait a minute. Do I see? Dun dun dun. <laughs> Ooh, I love the blush on its ears, very cute. There's actually a lot of blush all over this custom. This is why I own makeup, to blush my customs. Guys, it's turning red panda. What did they use? Oh, that's like the, that's the walking, I have a, it's like the walking um, panda, except I have a cat. Don't ask questions. <laughs> oh, I recognize this style too. That is so pretty. Oh my goodness, look at how it's painted. It's like a, it's like a artwork. Well, it is artwork, obviously. <laughs> it's like a, it's like a Monet painting with all the paint strokes. It's so surprising how many different styles people do on LPS Customs. It just looks so pretty. I love the eyes. I don't know if this is like a Pokemon or something, but it definitely looks like one. What did they use? Is that a chinchill? No. What are those like flying squirrels? Flying Squirrel LPS with a collie. Is that what that is? I love the color scheme. Another Pokemon looking Space Wizard cat I don't recognize. Look at the toe beans though. I always appreciate the toe beans. Very adorable. Oh. What? <laughs> oh my gosh. That is... What? How... Is that painted? Look at that... He oh, whoops. My Okay, so this is very interesting because I have seen something like this before, not the specific one. So the caption says, Littlest Pet Shop plus Pure Nemo. Pure Nemo? I don't know if that's a doll brand, probably. That is very interesting. What What is tripping me up a bit is because the the actual LPS head looks like printed. It's painted so well. I'm like trying to wrap my head around that being painted because it looks so smooth and clean. I... That is so cool. Is there more pictures? Oh, there are more pictures. There's more pictures. <laughs> that is very interesting. So this is an idea that a few people have had in the community. I just haven't seen it very often where you take a doll body and put on an LPS head or like make standing LPS like this, like anthropomorphic, I guess is the right word. I love this idea. It's so cool. Actually, okay, I'm gonna show you something. Guys, it's really cursed, so please don't judge me. Okay. <laughs> Oh, she's tall. I'm, oh my gosh, it's, I'm sorry. <laughs> it looks like Slender Man. And okay, so. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm, re I'm realizing how ridiculous this looks now that it's. <laughs> I'm sorry, I have to show this because it's relevant, but uh, I hope I don't scar you too much. I wanted to sculpt up an LPS body and just like see what it would look like. Um. As you can see, I don't know anatomy at all, so this looks super bad, and... <laughs> okay, this is a really bad example because I made it, so let's just put that over there. Okay, I have another example that's better. 
I believe that Pumpkins Customs made an anthropomorphic... Oops. Anthropomorphic LPS. Oh, here it is, here it is, here it is. Yes, okay, so here it is. She is so cute with her chunky little legs. I forgot what... Uh, pumpkin used. It's a G5 Cocker Spaniel head in an Equestria Girls mini body put together like a Frankenstein monster. Very accurate description. <laughs> I think this is just such a cool idea and I would love to see more customs like this. Just like doll type customs. I definitely want to try it. You know, I mean, I know I, I have, but <laughs> we are not going to talk about it. Okay. Anyway, I just want to say that is so interesting and I want to see more. This is very cool. I love her whole um, beachside type feel. Again, if people are watching this, especially customizers or people who want to be customizers, oh my gosh, like this is such a cool idea and it has not been utilized at all. Please, oh my, like if you like doll customizing, like there's so many doll, bleh, doll customizing people. You're inspired by doll customizing, you like Will's Fetch Shop. Try this, cause I really want to see more and I'm so excited to see what people will do with this idea. It is like just beginning. Like I've only seen a few, but I'm sure like soon people will start doing this. So cool. Oh my gosh, it's Candy. I know this artist. She made me this beautiful custom. Let me show it. Beatrice, where are you, my darling? Candy makes such beautiful customs. I mean, I already made a video unboxing Beatrice, but she is gorgeous and I love her. We're gonna put her right there in the background because she's relevant now. Help with, help with the white void existence. This is Candy's really adorable custom that has a lantern on its stand. It's, it's like this custom with a stand, except that lantern has like a light inside where she put an LED through it. That is amazing. <laughs> she makes such cool customs. It's got a little mushroom hat. Whoever owns this custom is so lucky and like, I hope they treasure it. <laughs> they have all the bragging rights. Oh, so we got like another one of these sort of cutesy um, I don't know what this style is called, just I guess kawaii type Japanese adorable style. I really like it. That looks like that looks like resin eyes almost. Like 3D resin eyes. Love how clumpy the little hair are. It's got like a clover on its butt. Little clover tail. <laughs> a little clover tail. I adore it. Very cute. Ooh. You got a little punk emo kitty here with little red eyes. Again, the spy collar, that is very impressive sculpting. Holy moly. Okay, but I'm really curious where you got those little piercings. Because I have some, but they're not that small. I do have my fair share, but I thought maybe they are. I want to make more pierced customs like that. Looks so cool. Oh my gosh, another old pumpkins custom. Look at those eyes. It's got little butterflies. Oh my gosh, the flowers. Guys, I need a flower mold like this because I've looked everywhere for like a cute little flower mold and I cannot find the right size. People are hoarding the flower molds and they won't tell me where they are. <laughs> this custom is so cute. I love its little angel type feel. Pumpkin makes amazing customs. I don't even have to say it. It's just beautiful. Ooh, this is very interesting. It's a polar bear base and they sculpted it on these huge ears. It kind of looks like a jackal. Oh, maned wolf. Well, I was close. <laughs> Maned wolf. I love looking at those. They're so beautiful. They live in South America, if you didn't know. In Brazil, I don't know where else. I know they're almost extinct in a few places. As it suggests, they look like a wolf, but also fox coloring. But they're so tall and elegant. They look ethereal. They're so beautiful. I definitely love seeing a maned wolf custom. And it kind of inspires me to do one. Holy moly. Like, I, I just was reminded of this really amazing animal that I should definitely make a custom of. <laughs> Put it on the list of a million customs I have to make. <laughs> of course, this was made by Little Leaf, not surprised. She makes beautiful customs. Oh, this is a very interesting. Okay, I'm sorry. I do not know why my butt keeps going forward. That is not how gravity is supposed to work, but here we are. It looks, this is like a little shark character made out of a wolf cat head, a collie body, and then they sculpt it on a little shark fin. That is very cool, wow. I love its eyes, they're super interesting. It's got the little type of bleeding mascara look. Band-aids all over it, very cute. <laughs> the shark tail looks like it has a chomp out of it, that's really funny. Maybe it's like a little piece of cake. Mmm. 
Thank you for joining me on this Pinterest journey. I should frequent frequent Pinterest more often because they're such beautiful customs. Guys, I promise I will stop filming in this white void soon because it just looks like a hospital room. <laughs> it's just too cold outside to film outside and it's making me mad. Ah! I'm leaving. I know you'll miss me, but I'm leaving. Have a good day. <laughs> hey, okay.